Hi guys, welcome back to Tech Tricks Info again. So this is a special video. This is on how to make a piston clock. So this is a real piston which was used inside an engine. The connecting rod, you can see the gudgeon pin, the circle etc. It's been done. Uh, so I'll uh, show you how to make it. See the entire video and learn how to do it. And also you can gift it to someone also. It's a very special gift actually. So uh, try it by yourself. So now let's see all the components required for it. So the piston, the gudgeon pin, the crankshaft, the balls and other components are there. So this is an old piston which is used in an existing engine which was failed. So uh, I have cleaned the piston and the connecting rod etc. Uh, I have cleaned it using kerosene and then I have used sandpaper to make it very clear. So here you can see I have electro plated it so it has a shining and beautiful appealing look. You can see the entire uh, components, the piston, the connecting rod, the balls etc. have been electro plated to have a fantastic shining look. Now we'll assemble it with the clock machine to make it a clock. So now let's go and identify the process. So that's my son Ethan assembling the gudgeon pin with the piston helping me. Thank you Ethan. So uh, now let's go and see the gudgeon pin is already there in the piston. So there's a connecting rod coming there. You can see the big end over there. So I'll be assembling the gudgeon pin to lock uh, the connecting rod with the piston over there. So that's the gudgeon pin being inserted uh, into the uh, hole over there to connect uh, the piston with the connecting rod so you can see uh, it's already been done uh, now so these are all the components that we require for making the piston clock so uh, that's a shell or the two bearings coming from the big end side of the connecting rod and the crankshaft it has been pasted to become a ring and that's the machine of the clock so that's uh, that uh, costs about two dollars nearly that is hundred rupees in the Indian market nearly okay and now the needles are there so this is the piston and the connecting rod which has been already assembled over there so that's the closing part of uh, the big end side right and that's the battery for the clock machine that's the bolt where the big end side will be locked in so that's all the components right there in front of us now let's go and see the assembling I have actually dubbed it so my lip movement won't be right so that's the piston and the connecting rod that you are seeing right now they which has been assembled and kept straight and that's the shell two bearings have been pasted together with the help of Fabi Quick over there it perfectly suits towards the big end side of um, the connecting rod because it is being taken from that part itself which is mating the connecting rod big end side and the crankshaft so that's the clock machine it perfectly suits into the shell so uh, it's easy for us uh, to assemble the entire part Okay, now uh, we have a sheet metal which has been cut in the shape of a circle so that the machine clock can be covered. Now what we do, we'll assemble the needles of uh, the clock with the clock machine over there. So the needles, the bigger needles, the smaller needles and the second needle which is in red is being uh, assembled with the machine. Okay, so that perfectly suits uh, towards the big end side of the connecting rod. So now let's uh, lock the big end side uh, with the bolt. I will not be tightening the bolt uh, very much in. We'll be doing it later. Right now I'll be just showing it uh, with a light tightening so that uh, you can see how it looked like. Right. So uh, that's how it's been done. You can see the piston clock is almost ready. Now uh, let's take a battery and insert it to see how it uh, starts to work so that's our battery I'll be inserting it and the needles will start to move so let's uh, slowly and carefully insert the battery and have a look at the second needle it's it has started to tick that's it tick 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 so that's it our clock is so ready that's that's a superb clock here for you so for more videos and technical videos you can visit our uh, website or our YouTube channel that is youtube.com or the tech tricks and thanks for watching this video try it by yourself best of luck